So I am going to be adding a pump to my cylinder on my homemade crane. Of course, call talk to the eBay person selling this and ask them, will this work vertical? They said yes. Well, look inside. No, it won't. It's made to be laying on its back. And it's three inches taller than they said it was. So we're cutting the bottom off. I'm gonna re-weld this back on. Put it in there. Let's make it siphon from the bottom like it needs to be. That's just an oil resistant rubber hose. Just pick up and just use the same filter. Alright. Cheap six pin trailer plug. Dollar a foot trailer cable wiring. I think this is six pin. You only need five. There's the other side. Bridge crane controller. Like 15 bucks on Amazon. Poke your hole. Got the tank in. Hydraulic lines in. Now I just gotta convert the cylinder, pull it apart, and pull the check valve out. Put it back together and see if it works. Alright, we got the cylinder off. So, kind of, kind of common sense. Reservoir, pull your nut off. Reservoir comes off. Shaft comes out. Careful of your seals. You're gonna break this pipe loose. Got kind of a keeper washer. Careful, take that out. You're gonna pull the check ball on the pump side. Put it back together. Then you disassemble the hand pump go to your hydraulic fitting store and if they know what the fuck they're doing they'll be able to get your metric thread that goes into here to a flared fitting and just make sure all your hoses and everything are PSI correct I know this thing can do 10,000 PSI I know I'm gonna lose a lot of lifting power because my pump only does 4,000 but the most I've ever lifted with this was a thousand pounds so even if this eight ton can do three ton i'm sure it's going to be enough let's get it back in <laughs> 